Hi everyone, this is your image imagineer and your lifestyle coach. After Diwali has come to the end and we have detoxed our house, our surroundings, it's time to de detox your inner self. Now how would you do that? First and foremost thing to detox your inner you so that you have a connection with the inner self is to set limits, set boundaries. Anything uh, which robs you of your inner peace is not worth it. You've got to set your boundaries and anything which is making you uncomfortable, you've got to go away from that scene to make yourself feel comfortable, to make yourself feel connected. That is how you set limitation, you set boundaries with others, with people, with surroundings. Also to find connection with your inner self, you need to find a relaxation technique. What exactly makes you unwind with the outer world what is your what is your favorite thing uh, which you can do to relax yourself is it a walk in the nature is it looking at the greenery is it listening to the nice music some kind of a meditative piece or what is it which makes you connect with your inner self um, Another thing to connect with your inner self is we must not make mountains out of molehills. Uh, certain things in life will not happen the way we are wanting it to happen. Things will go the way they have to go in their own due course. You as a person should not react to situations rather than respond to it and do your best what you can do and don't make mountains out of molehills. Let things pass. If they were not meant to be, let them go. Breathe them away. Slowing down is another way that you have to be connected with your inner self. Uh, this Diwali I saw everybody, I just visited a couple of places and people were, people were hassled, people were in a hurry. Um, I know if you haven't cleaned your house this Diwali, it's fine, it's okay, let the house be let the house be the way it is it's not necessary if you haven't got time to clean each and every nook and corner or to scrub it that you've got to be hassled about diwali now festivi festivities are meant to be celebrating not to hassle yourself out so if you haven't done things the way they were meant to be please slow down slow down your energies and anything which is not in sync with the inner you you need to connect it you need to revisit and re-strategize that what is it making you feel how is it making you feel are you making are you are you feeling anxious about not slowing down then probably it's not your cup of tea so slow down a little bit unclutter the world outside while uncluttering the world inside it's very important that you unclutter your inside world what is happening inside your head what are the thoughts um, what is the toxic environment which you're breeding in is it the toxic toxic circumstances the toxic people which are making you uncomfortable we we do a lot of uh, you know um, uh, uncluttering of the exterior world but as far as the inside uh, uncluttering is concerned we are completely disconnected with it so unclutter the inside thoughts because that is where everything has a connection if you are not settled in here you won't be settling in the outside world keep it clear and keep it away from all the negative thoughts and emotions um, again, uh, while uncluttering the outside world and the inside world, you also you also have to understand that what are you as a person. Now, for me as a person, if I go late anywhere for a meeting, that makes me feel very uncomfortable. So I have a weird sense of uh, you know uh, uh, discomfort when I come late for a particular meeting. So if you are that kind of a person, and if your energy is scattered because of coming late, try and be there at a place at least 10 minutes early because that makes you feel comfortable from within you are in control of yourself and uh, you are you are discounting yourself from a lot of negative emotions last and not the least is accept and let go uh, things are not meant to function the way uh, they are as you've decided in your head stress would be offered to you every day on the platter and uh, stress is something which we can't let go stress is going to make us 
churn make us twist and in spite of the stressful moments it's in our hands how we respond and react to the stressful moments so accept and let go things are not here permanently so don't hold on to the things and situations and people let them go breathe them away if they were meant to be in your life they would be there if they are not meant to be in your life they would not be there this is how you get connected to your inner self and we can do a lot on the outside to dress ourselves on the outside unless and until we are not connected with our inner self there would be a disharmony so try and have a connection with your inner self after this diwali there are just two months there to get into the new year detox your mind uh, rather than de detoxing your outer self and um, let the old habits old patterns go out of your life raise your consciousness to a level wherein you are complete sync and harmony with your inner self happy connecting with your inner self bye bye